Okay, and then how I can repair and what I can do if I have damaged cylinder head bolt. Look, now there is really situation that when I insert my tool and then when I rotate, this my tool slips. And, and this my tool, it is not anymore working because this bolt is damaged. And if we compare like in that another bolt, it is in here, and when I insert my tool, now there is direct contact and there is no any slippery in that array. Okay, and this is bad situation. But what I can do next? If I have one bolt in here, what is damage? It is in there. Damage bolt. Okay. Now I think that when I manage to open all of when I manage to open all others bolt, there was ten bolts and one of those bolts is now damaged and this bolt is damaged in here but all other bolts I managed to open. Nine is open and one is locked and off and stuck and now there is situation that there is no this is this bolt, this is new bolt and normally I should open that in this way but now it slips in their inner area because these inner areas, these dents, they are damaged. Okay, and what I can do next? Okay, and next I plan to do so that I, uh, that I take all of these okay bolts that are fine, I take those away in that way that I rotate those and soon I can lift those good bolts away in, in that way and then I need tongs if I have small tongs I can insert my tongs in here and lift these bolts up in that way and there is this used bolt and let's look at how I made it Press this bolt. There are my tongs. And in that way I lift up now all of these my nine OK bolts. There is now nine OK and one damage. OK. And next I will I will work so that I lift up all of these and I have in here nice T-bar that I can rotate this easily and first I take all of those nine away and then I have this one stuck left and let's look at what happens when I take nine these bolts away and then we can also use this magnetic tool that I lift these bolts in that and this is also a useful tool. This is, there is magnet in there. Okay. And, and then I continue my job. Okay, and now I have take all of these other cylinder head bolts away, but one this damage bolt in here. It is still left in that bolt. And what I am planning to do next? Okay, next I, I have idea that when I have this my cylinder head bolt, there is one OK bolt in here that I, I have in here drill bites. And next I am planning to do so that like in here this, this bolt is, is, not, is this position and next I am planning to drill that upper area away and I have this excellent uh, cobalt, cobalt HSS cobalt drill bites that are extremely durable and very tough steel and next I will do hole in that my what is this my damage bolt in here and I will take 
I will take that the central area away so that I drill this my drill through that nut and then I can take this my my cylinder head away okay and next I have a little bit drilling and let's start that job soon okay and here I have then this my drill and here are these my drill bites and first I am planning to do hole what goes in directly in that deepness in that level in here it goes in here to that area okay in this this amount and then I insert my I have two drill bites 10 millimeter and this is little bit bigger 11 millimeter and this 11 is like it is big and this is smaller it goes directly in this hole okay and there is this my target area and I I insert my drill drill pipe in their inner okay and then slow speed number one and then let's go to look closer there is this hole in there and I I insert my tool and then I start to do and then look idea is that I keep that my drill all time in directly that position not in this way directly and then I then I drill about 10 minutes and now I press a little bit down also this my drill bite okay and then even better Okay, let's look what I have made. I take light, light. Let's look. Okay, and there is small, small dot in there. Look, small central. And then I continue that that my job. And let's look that what happens when I there is this bolt and there is none bolt and next next i will continue my drilling and this drilling takes time i believe that maybe 10 to 20 minutes Okay, and now I continue my job and we can next look when I have drilled that 10 minutes. 10 minutes, coffee break and coffee break, but I continue my job. Okay, and my drilling, it has been continued. We can look in there, there is small dot in their inner area. But now I need new drill bite. And I have in here this best thin HSS thin and this, this should be the best quality, this thin, thin coating. It is like cold. And I use that because this bolt is so tight and so hard. And I replace my this uh, Drill pipe Okay, there is this my situation and I replace drill pipe
Joristis Nyt pilpait. It looks like that. Brand new. And this is old. And there is new. Okay, good. And then we go to look. That closer. This is my drilling. What is happening? There is this my target. In here. Good. And let's look at how this new drill pipe works. Okay, cool. It takes right away this cutting. And now I can add in their oil. Oil is I have this oil can. This oil can and I add in their oil that it lubricates this my bowl. Okay, good. And I don't press I don't press much this drill down drill down because this drill pipe can be damaged. And then I take a little bit better view. We can look that closer. There and that area can be looked at better in that way. Okay, good. And now there is even deeper hole and and I continue my job and I work about 10 minutes and let's look my result next. Okay, and there is close view of this my drilling. Again, and a little bit oil. Oil in there, and then drilling again. Then I take then I take a little bit bigger view. Even bigger you and a little bit oil.
Okay. Now I have quite deep hole. It is it is there. And I I think that now I have almost finished, but I continue my job. Okay, and we continue. Okay, and then suddenly I heard snap. Look. Now there happens something. Look. This bolt is in here. Bolt head. It is here. Now I have managed to cut that bolt. And here is this original bolt. And now I have drill in so long that it is really nicely in there. Look, this head, it isn't there. And it is snap. Excellent. Excellent work. Look. This part in here. Can we can we see that closer? And there is just this head. Head is there. Okay, cool. And now I can take this drill part out. That we can look also that view. Look. Very good work. It is really nice. And when we compare that, I drill in that way and it snaps directly. Okay, good. And then we can look also this this inner my working area. The what is their situation? What it liked. Okay, good. And now, now when we look in the inner, we can see that there is only this that this part in here. They're in. Can we see that? Yes, there. And now this cylinder head should be free. And let's look, is this true? And I take these parts away. And then when I move that head, yes, cylinder head is moved. Excellent, look that array. And then I can lift it out next. Okay, and then we have a close view. There is this bolt head, what I drill in, in this way. And there is this similar bolt, what we can see in the inner. But I, I made this my drilling in that way. And then it goes through. Very interesting. 
Tärastis poolt. We look that. You can see that. Tärastis poolt. It looks like that. Can we see any better, better view? Okay, and it cuts so nicely. It cuts really, really nicely. Okay, good, and easy, easy job. Okay, and then I can lift the cylinder head up that way nicely. Good. And then we can look those pistons, what are in there. Okay, and then final part, when I have this bolt in here, what I cut, what is in here, the situation, there is this OK bolt, and here is this my drilling bolt head, and now, that how I can take now this bolt away, what is in here, that bolt, that is cut. It is so easy that it is loosened already because there is no any tension and then I, I can only I can only rotate that. Look, so easy. And I insert that part in here. It is so easy to take out. Okay. And there is this bad cylinder head bolt, and this is okay. And now I finish that how to remove this bad, bad cylinder head bolt. Okay, and then we need to install new bolts, and we can then install cylinder head and parts back.